Coach, is it still kind of a learning process on how to handle the uh, the short weeks and how to I mean, <clears throat> maybe doing too much, too little, and stuff like that? Well, it's not an exact science. you got to back off a little bit. It kind of depends on the time of year, too, so that uh, it, it even moves around from that standpoint. I guess every Pac-12 team has to deal with it at some point, but w w would you rather have them kind of get rid of the, the Friday games altogether and stick to just the <coughs> Saturday, Saturday? Well, I think Friday's for high school. I, I, I don't, the one thing, the, one, the biggest negative on Friday games, <coughs> and it's fun for people to watch Friday games, the biggest negative is I think it takes some of the spotlight away from the high schools. Jameer and Renard out of Cathedral, obviously both pretty small guys, and, and, and Renard wasn't recruited quite as heavily as Jameer. Do you have any reasoning to, to, to understand kind of why that was? That both was quick guys and both productive there, and Jameer got, got a little bit more recruitment. Do you, do you think that was because people felt like they missed on Renard? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. Um, I think, and then I also think, though, uh, Cathedral, which they've had success for a while, maybe they had more success or something. I don't That's a, that's a good question. Um, but uh, they, you know, they have quality guys, and, and they're typically a fast team. Did, did you get any sense at all that Jameer was was going to be flipping the night before? I know you had a few coaches down there at his house, and it seemed like he was pretty firm to, to Nebraska at that point. We we knew we were in it from the beginning. I mean, we knew we were in it. We knew we were in it uh, at the end, and we felt like it'd be tight. And same with Halid too, because Halid was, was kind of going back and forth between a few schools. Yeah, um, we we. Uh, Felt like we were in it. We didn't, didn't know exactly how it'd come out, but in both cases we felt good. Uh, um, you know, we you know, you, you know you never know on these things because strange stuff happens. But um, uh, we, we felt good about our chances, but also knew that uh, it could flip too. Both of those are, are kind of, both Jameer and Renard are kind of unique personalities away from the football field. How would you kind of characterize those guys when they're not on the line? Well, they both have fantastic personalities. Renard's a real bubbly, unique guy, and, and Jameer's a quieter guy, but uh, he's got a lot of personality to him, too. I mean, uh, yeah, you get to know them. They're both kind of the, uh, two more lively guys around here. Good. Uh, All right. Thanks, Coach. One more thing oh. of mine. Yeah, I mean, Jason Gesser has been a, been a pretty influential part of the football program, and he, he, he resigned early. Do you have any, any kind of reaction to, to the things that have been going on the last week? With well, I didn't know he resigned, so that's news to me. Uh, I don't. I mean, because I, I, I don't know, you know, I don't know the facts. I mean, I overheard some some of the stuff reported, but, you know, I mean, from what I know, it's just word of mouth, so I don't know. Hope, hopefully none of it's true. All right, All right thanks. Thank you.